this break. Hello, Facebook and YouTube! You might be wondering, what in the world was that opening? Well, I just want to let you guys know, you are in for a very special treat, because today I will be giving my first Taylor Hildebrand story. That's right, I'm not going by Mr. Bubble, which I will normally be going by on my other channel. Today, I will be giving you guys my first story for my life that hopefully will give you a little crack. Alright, so about two years ago, um, we had just moved into my new house, and that's actually when I started my YouTube channel, The Bubble Studio. We had uh, decided that we would go on a vacation to Mexico because uh, this woman that my mom was working with at this preschool decided that she was going to start a school down in Mexico, specifically in Puerto Vallarta. So my mom was like, oh, this is so cool. We get to go out of the country, go down to Mexico for like two weeks or whatever. So we go down there and it's all awesome and stuff. And uh, we're having a great time. But then I start getting really sick inside. Um, there was this special name they had for this bug that gets into your stomach, kind of like the stomach flu. I can't remember the name of it. It was something that translated into... This is horrible! You're super sick and you're gonna die after you have diarrhea! Yeah, I, I had the big D. Anyway, so this went on for about a week and a half where I was just feeling super sick inside and there was one thing especially that really did not help my cause and that was I can't take pills. And so I had to drink everything out of like one of those little cup thingies. It kind of looked like this, in a way. You guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, so I had a drink from that. And uh, my Aunt Christina, who's actually my mom's stepdad's sister, uh, lives down in Mexico. She started this whole business and stuff. That's for another story. Anyway, um, and when my grandma Mo goes down there, my grandma, she always stays in this really nice hotel. But we, since we were staying there for so long, decided that we would go stay in an apartment. But we decided to have lunch at this hotel area. So we head down there with my Aunt Christina. So we get there and we're like in the middle of lunch and stuff like that. And I start having these stomach pains again. I'm like, oh my gosh. And uh, just so you guys know, my Aunt Christina is really cool. But she lives in Mexico. And so she's kind of wild in a lot of ways, but she's really cool. Anyway, so as we're sitting there, I'm like, mom, I, I really don't feel good. I really, like, I'm having the stomach pains all over again, and I don't want to go use those restrooms, even though they're really nice. I don't want to drop a bomb in there. That's embarrassing. So my mom's like, okay, well, Taylor, then in that case, you can take this pill, which will make you semi-constipated, but since you're already having diarrhea, it'll just kind of even things out, like, whew, you know, and your body, I was like, I want, phew, you know, that's what I want. It's right now, I'm like, bleh. Aunt Christina, here's this whole conversation rising. So I say, Mom, you know I can't take this pill. She's like, oh, Taylor, if you want to feel better, you're going to have to take this pill. My mom is kind of annoyed at this point. So she, she's like, Taylor, if you, don't ha if you have not taken this pill, by the time I get back from using the restroom, it's getting down. I'm like... Oh, crap. Because if my mom says it's going down, she knows Taekwondo or karate or something. She told me I've gotten karate chopped right in the neck before. Doesn't feel good. So my mom says it's going down. It's going down. I was, I was kind of like, goodness. So she stands up and walks away and my Aunt Christina pipes up. She says, Taylor, I have two dogs, as you know. And uh, here's the thing. When my dogs are sick, I have them take pills. But the way I have to take pills is very simple. This is basically a simplified version of what she said. She's like, take their mouths and open it like so, right? I put the pill in their mouth. And then I close their mouth, holding their jaw attached to their upper head, and hold it there. So I'm like watching her as she's like giving me this demonstration. And um, I have to say, I was like, there's no way. There is no way she's going to do this to me. And uh, she says, Taylor, go ahead, take the pill. So I take the pill, put it in my mouth, take some water. This is like the fifth time already. And I'm like drinking it. And I think I got it. So I kind of swallow, and there's the pill, the freaking pill. So my Aunt Christina 
stands up from the table and walks over to me. It's like going around. My sister's on the other side, just watching me. I'm like, oh, that was, that was gross. Not nah, just went everywhere. She like comes over to me. She takes a pill and takes this mango sauce that we had for our tortilla chip. And she like takes it, puts the pill in there. It's like mixing it around. It's like, here we go, Taylor. I'm like, oh. And she like shoves it into my mouth. I'm like, oh. She takes some like lemonade that I had like sitting there, like pouring it down in between the cracks of my orifice. And closes my jaw, puts her hand over my jaw, and her hand over her, and like this. And like pouring the lemonade also in while she's doing this. I'm like freaking out on the inside. I'm like, right? And she's like, oh. I'm like, and she's like shoving. It down my throat, and finally I just I'm like nodding like oh, 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 and she lets it go and walks back to her seat. I'm like trying to swell. I think I I think I got it down because there's like chunks of this mango stuff that feels just like the pill. Swallowing, finally it's done. I'm like oh, I swallowed it. There's the pill. There's the freaking pill in. My hand. Not in my stomach where it should be. I'm like, why didn't you just go home back to my stomach, you stupid little pill? We made a pretty big scene, obviously, because people were like looking at us from across the restaurant area. Evidently, as my mom was coming back from the restaurant, our waiter had walked up to her and said, Is your son okay? She didn't know what that meant. She was off the bathroom. She comes back, everything's fine. Aunt Christina plays it off like nothing happened. And I'm just sitting there. Kind of still freaked out, kind of like, and Victoria's just kind of like, this is awkward. This, this is real awkward. The pedal still sitting there. I came up with this idea. I don't know, I think it was a pretty good idea. I take the pill with my fork and knife and mush it up into a little powdery substance that kind of looked like cocaine, to tell you the truth. Pour it into my lemonade, which at this point, it's only about that full. I mix that up. Down the hatch. No! No, it couldn't just go down the hatch. Right? And go through the way of the dogs to get it down. Luckily, me and Christi me and Aunt Christine are still friends. I bring it up and she laughs. I sit in the corner and cry. It's embarrassing. It truly was. But you know what? I did feel better. I have a question for you. Are you taking pills? And if you're not, do you want to go through the way of the dog? <laughs> that, was a, that was a dumb way to end it. Um, yeah. So, make, uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And more stories are on the way. More funny stories are on the way. Please subscribe. And uh, please like and share this video. And thank you. Goodbye, Facebook and YouTube. Ah!